So we are you have so we are headed to check out the house. It's done. It's not done yet, but it's Where's not it? it's not done. But they put the shingles on the roof. The, and the we are um this is our house coming up oh, yeah. right there. Wow. Wow. They put all the shingles on the house. Now they're gonna be putting on the bricks. Oh my gosh. Go all the way out there. I know it's a fire hydrant, but so we're getting ready to do uh, the house tour of the framing and the windows are in. So yeah, so they have the roof on, all the shingles are up, the windows are in, the framing is done. It's moving so quickly, a lot quicker than I thought it would have. I thought it was gonna be a little bit slower of a process, but these jokers put like on a whole roof in one day. That's crazy. I didn't know they could move that fast. So about to take you guys around, uh, go room for room, help you visualize what it will look like, kind of. I'm gonna see if I can put my mind's eye to it too because I'm a, I'm a finished product kind of person. But we're gonna take you room by room and bring you along for the ride. So, so um, this is our two car garage that it's gonna have a double door. Um, I didn't want each door to be single because I felt like that would be too much. So this one is just a double and then we have two single doors over here. Come on boys. So we're gonna be super safe and you stay with me please. Look on the ground. Um, so this is gonna be our entryway. I love it, I love how deep it is. So then our doors and you come in and here's our hallway. And then this is gonna open up to our dining room. So this will be our dining room over here. So you're gonna be basically like, <laughs> Yeah, you just walked in the garage. So this is our dining room here. And you can see Cyrus right here. So we're gonna walk, walk, walk. And walking through here, this is our butler pantry. So um, we'll have a bar here with a, refriger a wine bar, refrigerator, ca double cabinetry, so cabinetry here. We do have glass double doors that are gonna be there. So that goes all the way through to our living room. So walking over here. We are gonna have our powder bath here. So you guys can see the plumbing. And I love that the ceilings are not like super low. Um, so this will just have a pedestal sink and a toilet. Um, and then we have like our, where our coats are gonna go, like our little mudroom area here is gonna be there because this walks out to our garage. So again, this is our double door garage. And I feel like, Dad, this looks bigger than two car garage. Mm -hmm. This looks like two and a half. So we are going to um, do epoxy floors for everything. Um, and we're gonna get custom cabinetry in here. So that's gonna be really nice. So this is our guest bedroom. Um, we'll have a walk-in closet that's Calvin's weaving in and out. Calvin, nope, you're staying here. So a walk-in closet here. As you guys know, my mom does live with me, so she will appreciate that. Um, here she will have, um, and our guests, just in general, will have a shower, and um, so this will be a standstill shower, and then a sink. So in our previous house, we did not have a bathroom in our guest bedroom, and so it kind of was like a pain when our guests wanted to use the bathroom, because their bathroom was right off the main hallway. So. Camera would be busting in the bathroom. When my mom's trying to get ready, the boys are like, I have to use the restroom because it's like the main one downstairs. So now our guests will have their own bathroom. You're getting so dirty in here. You're such a dirty, dirty mess. Dirty day in the world. Oh, <laughs> um, so moving forward, this is our under the stair closet. And um, oh. I wanna make sure that I do this justice because I love this so this is like a big oval and it looks all the way up and it's going to be completely open wow if you look up it looks humongous it's so amazing and we, and we want a stair what, what wait a minute so this is going to be a curved staircase and we did decide to go with um hardwood on our stairs 
so it curves all the way up and this will all be open so there will be a railing here um and then this will be a railing oh, all the way so it's gonna over like look down on everything yes, i can uh i love it all right so this is my favorite space because this is gonna be a big great room where it has our living room um our informal dining over there and then our, it opens up to our kitchen but why i particularly love this is that our house right now has um a two-story living room calvin stop doing that and um i don't know we just felt like yeah it was just like a waste of space like for us we and i wanted something with character and so now we're gonna get the peak ceiling um like that and then it's gonna have cedar beams and i'm gonna absolutely love it and i just feel like it wasn't about necessarily getting a bigger house um and this house is a thousand square feet bigger than our house right now but we just wanted a better layout and i just feel like it's gonna have so much more character and that's what we were looking for and then over here is our study um so this will be really nice because it is going to overlook this will eventually be like water here um so we did play a premium to be on the green belt and so this will be like all done and then it will go to a pond that's on the back there so that will be nice and then there's a closet in here which will be nice uh-huh how do you not know What's going on in your house? It's got, I mean, I figured there's closet somewhere in there. So, um, and then to bring you back to this side, so this is that butler pantry that I was saying. So you walk all the way through it, and then Rick's will have his, I'm sure, stock bar all ready to go. Um, and then our windows, and then we'll have a fireplace in the center, and then probably our TV will probably be right there. Look how dirty Cyrus is. A thing like a TV, I absolutely love. This is the first time, guys, I have we've been in it with the peak ceilings. Yeah. So also with this house is that standard is a flat ceiling, and then we paid for to upgrade it to make it a peak ceiling, but then we paid additional to make it two feet higher. And I am so glad we did. It looks so nice. Um, okay, so coming over here, we have our informal. So we do have a formal dining. You know, actually, we were looking at some floor plans, and I guess I have to thank my husband for that because we were considering not getting... Calvin, why are you dancing? Um, giving up our informal and just having one. And he was like, Taryn, we need to keep two. So we have our informal here. And then this will be our kitchen. You know I have that on video now. Oh, whatever. I'll say it And our kitchen will be so open. Oh, thank you. And then here we will have a pocket office, which will be nice. So we'll have our study in a pocket office. And then our pantry is yeah. here. We can walk in. And then our um, laundry room. So it's going to be nice. It's going to have cabinetry. It's going to have sink. Um, on this side I believe and then our washer and dryer will be over here which will be really nice and it's a little bit bigger than our one now so it'll just give me a little bit more space it actually is like a room rather than ours now is like a hallway we are in our master bedroom which we decided to push out the wall and do a bay window just to give it some more space which is super nice. I'm so glad we did it because it also gives us additional two windows. We would have just had two windows. So now we have four. And then it has like a cove where we'll put our dresser and our mount our TV. Oh gosh, Calvin. Look at this. Calvin, Cyrus, why are you in here? I cannot believe the windows are all in and everything. So our master bath we um man the tub the oval looks bigger so we decided to make it two feet bigger um and so it's gonna be his and hers vanity over here you said our house now looks bigger? no i said this hole looks bigger so and i was just saying how we did two feet bigger he's on the ground and then calvin you're not getting in the bathtub um our closet is gonna be back here and we did yeah, extend it by my office for it. <laughs> yeah i took some of his 
study out and I added I think two feet so it makes it a little bit bigger but there's so much stuff and the kids are following me so you guys will not be upstairs so I'm gonna take you guys upstairs really fast all right so I am looking down here's our staircase coming to come but, but I'm not gonna let the kids go up here um, because it is a bunch of stuff going on where I really feel like we'll fill the space, the 1,000 square feet, is a bigger upstairs. This whole space is our theater room. All here. So that's where we'll have the TV back here. And completely, we may even do like a wet bar, I'm not sure. So when you walk up the stairs, it puts you right into the game room. So this is the boys' game room right here. And it kind of has this weird little cove, and I'm still trying to figure out what to do here. Um, and then here's the boys' tech and library room. So we're gonna have like built-in desk here, um, and this will be like kind of like their study corner, their library. So here, and we did decide to, so we despise carpet. So we actually decided to do carpet I'm sorry, hardwood floors, even upstairs. So we're gonna have hardwood all here to these doorways, basically. And then we are gonna do hardwoods here in the library room, and then all the way up to the, the doorways there. Um, we just felt like it was kind of tough because we knew we wanted hardwood floors in um, on our stairs and we didn't know how to do it without making it look like not disjointed so yeah that's why i was like this cannot be little kids up here so i guess you're a big kid huh yeah, I'm a man. oh please all right so this will actually just be a hand railing all of this and then this is a wall i think and then this is open here and then this is going to be a railing and then here is going to be a railing and this will all overlook and so you guys can see kind of what the view will be like looking down and then we'll have our chandelier coming down here that we already have and it's just waiting in our garage so hold on two seconds so here is a bedroom this is a nice size bedroom okay that's fine I like that it has hallways. So then here's a bathroom here. And so these two rooms will share this bathroom. And so then we'll have our linen closet here. And then I love this one because this one's going to have like a peak ceiling. So here's another bedroom in the attic space. So this is going to be another room. And a walk-in closet there. This space is so much larger, like all of it, than what I was anticipating. All right, so here's another closet. You heard my husband fussing about how I'm going to decorate it. And then here's another one. This one ha will also have like a peak vaulted ceiling here. So this one is going to be a little bit bigger. And this one will actually have its own bathroom. Oh, so which one do you think is bigger? That one or this one? So this is nice. And this one will have a huge closet. No, this one is probably going to be Cyrus, Cyrus's and Calvin's room. What? They're sharing a room. Two people in one room. So? Like, so? Cameron. So Calvin and um, Cyrus are going to share a room, so we'll probably give them this room because they have a bigger closet. Cameron. And I like it because they're in the back, so. so. Yeah, it's a full tub. Oh, so you guys can see the water from here. So um, this will kind of all run through. And this is going to be a trail that goes all the way through, like a running trail, which will be nice. So we love it. And we love that we're only going to have a neighbor on the right side of our house. 
All right, so that was the framing of the home. So right now they've got the shingles up, electrical, uh, what else they do? Electrical, brickwork, that type of stuff. I guess that'll be happening here shortly. I'm so excited. You're, he's excited, mom's excited, kids are excited. I'm starting to get excited. <laughs> what? You should have already been excited. Well, I start thinking about the money. Sure, daddy. The money. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment down below, hit that bell so you know when we post something else. See you next time. Really, Taryn, you're just going to walk up in my frame. And, uh, Sorry. Oh, oh, okay. Bye, guys.